So I think the challenge in kidney cancer in 2020 is with the onslaught of IOIO and IOTKI therapy, the most common IOTKI therapy being a TKI in Lida plus pembrolizumab or Ipinevo, um, that the use of TKI monotherapy in the frontline setting has diminished. It clearly is the treatment of choice in the second line setting post IO, uh, but there are patients who have comorbid disease, who, ha who are requiring steroids or other uh, immunosuppressive agents that make them not great candidates for IOs. And in those patients, I certainly would use an agent like cabozantinib uh, to offer a disease that's known to be driven by VEGF, where IOs are not safe, uh, that approach. I don't think that's many patients, but certainly we have to keep in the back of our minds that TKI still have efficacy in the frontline setting for the people that are not able to get safely IOIO or IOTKI combinations.